Hey guys, all right, let's get to it. Here's the before of the closet that I share with my husband. It is a total mess of pre-baby, maternity clothes, and everything in between having three kids in six years. So when Presley came home with this clothing drive flyer for charity, I knew that it was finally time to tackle this closet, and we did it in one day. All right, so step one, clear everything out. I took everything from my closet, there goes nothing, excuse me, <laughs> and dumped it on my couch. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I have to warn you, this is somewhat of an overwhelming approach. Not funny. But it certainly forces you to start. I think I've committed. Please. Number two, sort into piles, definite giveaways. All right, Demony, pre-kids, keepers, some things you can't get rid of. We'll hold on to this. Yeah. Things that need to be ironed or clean. Things beyond repair. <laughs> this used to be my favorite sweater, Presley! And stuff you aren't sure about. Maybe that. Try on. That was definitely the biggest pile. Look at, I think my try on pile is getting way too big. My advice here is to be decisive. Don't need that anymore. Be quick. Know that it's gonna get worse before it gets better. I've got it all under control. And just gotta keep going. You just gotta tackle it. Oh. Step number three, try on. As you guys, I didn't realize just how much my body and my style has changed since having kids. Mommy. Look how short this is! Hey. I seriously can't keep it up. We're not putting this on the internet. This was tough. I made a decision to not hold on to old favorites, hoping that maybe one day they would fit, and really focus on what looks good on me now. And if there were similar items, I don't need all of these. I really wanted to pick my favorite, so I had less redundancy in my closet. Okay. And guys, it is extremely helpful to have someone there for encouragement. Katie from the office was nice enough to be there and give me her fantastically honest opinions. It's bad, no. <laughs> and when we were done, I was just so proud of these two huge garbage bags of giveaways because I know my clothes, especially the work stuff, are really gonna help someone. Number four, arrange your clothes back in the closet. I was kind of obsessed with switching to wooden hangers. For my pants, I tried these awesome open-ended ones, and then I piled everything in categories on my bed, like tank tops and dresses, and then it was finally time to put them back in the closet with as little interruption as possible, putting things that I wear less frequently in the back and vice versa. And you guys, I just wanna mention that with wooden hangers, you can't fit as many clothes in. I actually think this is a really good thing for me. Also, for items that slip, you might need these anti-slip grips. And then finally, clear the floor. So you guys, this is supposed to be a walk-in closet. It definitely wasn't. So I started by getting rid of whatever this is. I'm really sorry, Ross. And we hung up the belts and the scarves. There you go. And then we got this great storage bench that you can open up and put the duffel bags and random stuff in just to keep them out of sight. And now the kids can sit and hang out in my closet. Hi. <laughs> we didn't go crazy with like wallpaper or chandeliers, but Presley did make a couple drawings that I think look really cute. We hung up my jewelry which looked great. All right guys, so here it is, the before and the after. I can't tell you how much better this feels. I'm actually happy to walk into my closet and pick my clothes out in the morning. I just can't recommend this enough. You really just have to set aside a day, get it done, and you will feel so good. So you guys, I hope this inspires you. I'm gonna link up everything we used in our new Amazon store. Yes, it is about time we have this. All of the stuff we use in our videos is now in one place, so I will link that below to check out. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.